G'day guys, welcome back to Pete's God Adventures. Um, this evening, we're doing just a little crushing video. Um, James, a subscriber to the channel, asked me if I could crush some, apparently, and I've seen some of the quartz, very rich quartz. So, we've actually done a bit of a run, so we've done about half a bucket, and we've still got um, another half a bucket or so to go, but this gold in this quartz looked amazing, so it's gonna be really interesting for when he does a pan off to see what he's got. But um, yeah, I'll just show you what we've done so far. So we've crunched it down fairly small. So it's sort of down to you know, sort of half inch, maybe three quarter inch size. Um, but I have seen some visible gold going <laughs> into the crusher. So it's gonna be a few little round balls in there. But we've done sort of half a bucket. So this is the material that's come out of it. So it's basically just turned to sand. So I did replace the hammers. They were quite smashed to pieces, the old ones, and put, um, Basically, it's a bit of square bar. Alrighty, guys, so these are the old hammers. As you can see, they are quite narned. They have done a lot of work. Actually, not that much. This was six mil steel, and as you can see, completely bananaed. So now I've got some 10 mil bar in there, so hopefully that'll do a little bit better than the uh, these guys. But yeah, nice fresh ones for this crush. Alrighty, guys, we're gonna get stuck back into it. Um, shove the rest of this through, and we'll see what we come up with. It. We've ran a whole lot of that that quart, so I believe it's probably a good 20 kilos plus. <laughs> I think of all that. So um, yeah, well, what we've got also we're having to play around with is a rotor pan. I've not seen one before, so don't know how many of you guys out there have seen one. But yeah, we'll do a little bit of demonstration of that uh, in a minute, and we'll see how it goes. So we can process a lot of material quickly. Um, it is very fine material, so if the rotor pan doesn't quite work right, we do have it in the bottom of the tub still, so we haven't lost it, so we can always rerun it. Anyway guys, I'm going to crack this sucker open and see if we've got any nice little balls of uh, gold locked up inside. Alrighty guys, so that is what's left in the bottom. The uh, hammers are looking fairly second hand. But yeah, that's probably a good 20 kilos worth. So yeah, quite rounded off. But yeah, we'll get this lot out. And we might just do a special little pan just with this bit here. Because I have a feeling this may have a few nice little, uh, little balls of gold happening, hopefully. Alrighty guys, we'll get set up and we'll see how we go. Alrighty guys, so this is actually, we had a bit of a camera malfunction. This is actually some, some concentrates from nine scoops and what was out of the hammer mill. So, we'll give this a little shake around. What's out of the mill? The mill didn't actually have that much in it. It's like a couple little little bally bits, but yeah. So we've got a bit of a happy smile going on there. So yeah, that's about nine scoops, um, which wouldn't even be wouldn't even be quarter of a bucket. So we'll uh, get set up. We'll give this uh, rotor pan a crack, and yeah, we'll see how that goes. Alrighty, hey guys, here we go. I'm a rookie at this, so don't judge me too harshly. <laughs> but um, yeah. So what we've got in here, there is a bucket in here, you just can't quite see it. Just there. So we're gonna sit this in here and hook it on the edge of the bucket. All hooked on. Get the rotor pan that put on the dowel there in the middle. So we're gonna find it. That's the one there. So basically I've gotta go 180 degrees. So there to there. Whilst feeding 
And then we're gonna do a couple of swirls like that, that way. Like, yep, righto. I'm getting a nod. So we're gonna try and just feed it, see how my coordination goes. Can't come up now. It's always nicer that in anticipation to send the uh, goal card. So, what is this? This is four pretty loosely rotor panned scoops. It's a fairly thick little little bead of gold going on there. I'll just sort of flatten him out a bit. That's actually that's actually quite. Well, there's a couple of nice little ones there too. It looks a bit deceiving. It all bunches up, but when you sort of flatten it out, that's actually not a bad bit of gold. That'd have to be quarter of a gram, I reckon. So it'd be interesting. So uh, once James runs this whole bucket, so I still have. That bucket down there, which is, uh, I think it's a 15 litre bucket. There's about 13 litres of uh, sand to go. So if we're getting a quarter of a gram from about four scoops, uh, I think he's going to be doing pretty well. So it'll be interesting. So what we'll do, guys, James will probably run the rest of this. And um, yeah, you'll send us a photo when he's done, all cleaned up, and we'll see what we've got. Alrighty guys, well that's it for this little mini episode of Pete's Gold Adventures, um, the crushing edition, yeah. So I'll get a photo of the final weigh-in, so yeah, it's about, would have been probably 20 kilos, I'd say, of crushed um, quartz. Um, hopefully we'll get upwards of, well, maybe 4 or 5 grams would be awesome. But yeah, I'll get a photo, I'll stick it below, um, so you can have a look at the total. But anyway guys, if you like this episode, don't forget to share, like and subscribe, and we'll catch you on the next one. Cheers. Oh, 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 oh,